Hi, my name's Andrew Fairley. I'm Chef Patron of Restaurant Andrew Fairley. My name's Stephen McLaughlin. I'm the head chef of Restaurant Andrew Fairley at Glen Eagles. The restaurant's been here for that's 13 years old. We're a two-star Michelin restaurant. We rely predominantly on using as much as we can local Scottish produce. We use more modern techniques rather than, you know, modern style, I suppose. My role here as head chef at Restaurant Andrew Fairley, I'm kitchen manager. I'm responsible for anything that comes in the door from produce, daily deliveries to staff, um, day-to-day running of the kitchen, day-to-day management of the menus, what we serve to customers, and very importantly, the training as well of the young uh, all the way through to the senior staff as well. We've got 11 in the team just now. We've got kitchen porter, um, we've got head chef, myself, senior sous, junior sous, and then six, six chefs below that. We have to have the confidence on the, the product in the first place. We have spent and still spend a lot of time sourcing the best that we can possibly get. And our farmers and our producers really is the start of our quality control. So we have to have a relationship with them that's very tight where they understand absolutely what we're looking for. You saw on the farm this morning with um, John and George, the amount of effort that they put into what they do. You know, the animal husbandry, that's four generations of farmers. So Scotch lamb for us, it just gives us that absolute um, confidence that it has the farm assurance, it has the, the controls, the inspections along the way. So it's very, very strictly controlled before we get it. And it just really just gives us chefs the confidence to know that um, it has the honesty and integrity attached to the, to the animal, to the beast before it comes to us. Um, today we're cooking slow roast and confit Scotch lamb with tomato and fennel. This is the flank of lamb. We have a very simple marinade for 12 hours, and then we'll vac pack it, put it into a pouch, and seal it on full power, and then we'll cook it in the water bath at 78 degrees for 48 hours. This is what comes out of the water bath. We take it out of the pouch and we pat it dry, and then in between grease proof under a, quite a light weight, um, we press it overnight. If there's any excess fat, on there, we would etch it off. So then what we do now is we cut our portion. So this would be now, this would now be mise en place, ready for the service. The second cut we're going to use is the feather blade of Scotch lamb. We would then put this into a water bath. So after 12 minutes, we would take our feather blade of Scotch lamb out of the bath. It's 56 degrees cuisson, we'll season, salt and pepper. And we'll put the fatty side in onto the plaque. So I'm just now loading up my time brush with the, with the fat from the, the rendered fat from the Scotch lamb. I'm just going to add a little bit of uh, extra virgin olive oil and then I'm adding my feather blade. So we've got um, on the bottom, we've got roast aubergine puree. And then on top of that, we're going to add a little bit of tomato fondue. And to that goes the crisp confit flank of Scotch lamb. Just onto the plate. Some fresh shaved fennel, a little bit of fennel herb, and a little bit of torn basil leaf. New lamb dish for the menu. Slow cooked roast feather blade of Scotch lamb with crisp confit flank, tomato fondue and roast aubergine. Mm. It's beautiful. Tender. Mm. It's gorgeous. Mm. Fantastic, beautiful balance. I love the raw fennel on it as well. Um, that's perfect, perfect tasting menu dish. Mm.